Hello there and welcome to another live broadcast concert here at Van Tile Music Academy in Huntington Beach, California. If you've never seen these before, what we do is we bring our students in and they perform songs for you um, to watch and enjoy. So hopefully you'll stick around for the broadcast today and see all the great students we have performing. The theme we're doing today is a theme of the Beatles and Led Zeppelin. Um, two iconic bands that we wanted to celebrate. And we've got some other students who are performing songs that are not um, from those groups as well, but the majority of the songs you hear today will be from those two bands. So we're going to kick it off right now with one of our first guitar students. Uh, his name's Dominic Nguyen. Dominic is nine years old and started taking lessons with us in 2018. He's been a student for a little over a year now, and he's in our Guitar Ninjas program in the blue level. And it just so happens that one of the songs in that level is a Led Zeppelin song. So we're going to kick it off with that song. The song's called Hey Hey, What Can I Do from the 1982 Led Zeppelin album Coda. Here he is, Dominic Nguyen. There he was, Dominic Nguyen, performing Hey, Hey, What Can I Do from the 1982 album Coda by Led Zeppelin. Great job to Dominic. <clears throat> Our next performer, also on guitar. We're moving back to electric guitar and back to Led Zeppelin from their first album, which was just titled Led Zeppelin, but is also referred to as Led Zeppelin 1. The song Communication Breakdown, released in 1969. So playing that song today is going to be our guitar student. He's 11 years old, and his name is Ryan Cassianti. Ryan has been taking lessons with us here at the school since 2016. He is one of our guitar instructor, Eddie, uh, uh, students. And Ryan is also in our blue level of the Guitar Ninjas program. So he's been working real hard on a lot of different tunes for the last four years, uh, three and a half years or so. And today he's going to be performing for you again. Here it is, Communication Breakdown by Led Zeppelin. <laughs>
There he was, Ryan Cassianti, performing Led Zeppelin's Communication Breakdown from their first album, just titled Led Zeppelin, or sometimes referred to as Led Zeppelin 1. Great job by Ryan. We're going to switch over to our drum program now. Uh, the drum portion of our program, these students take lessons from our drum instructor, Ian Foreman. Who, Ian's been teaching lessons uh, with us here since 2018 uh, or 2019. And uh, he teaches Monday through Thursday each week. That's the days our drum program runs. So we're going to go sticking with the Led Zeppelin theme from the Led Zeppelin 3 album. Uh, in released in 1970, the song is called Immigrant Song. The performer is going to be Remy Cluey. Remy is nine years old. She's been taking lessons with us for just over a year. She started in February of 2019. So here she is a year later getting ready to perform Led Zeppelin's Immigrant Song. A um, little about the song, one of the great live versions. It's the opening track from the album How the West Was Won. So if you're looking for a great live version of that song, uh, it's the opening track on that album. Again, that live album from Led Zeppelin is How the West Was Won. It's a phenomenal drum beat performed by, of course, the iconic John Bonham. So here she is now ready to perform Remy Cluey performing Immigrant Song by Led Zeppelin. There she is, Remy Cluey, performing Immigrant Song by Led Zeppelin. Our next performance is going to stick with that Led Zeppelin theme, stick with that tribute to John Bonham, one of the most iconic drummers in rock and roll history. And the performer is going to be Tyler Cazianti, the older brother of Ryan, who performed uh, Communication Breakdown just a few moments ago. Tyler is going to be performing one of my favorite Led Zeppelin songs, The Ocean, which uh, was on the 1973 album Houses of the Holy. Fun thing about The Ocean for you music nerds out there, switches time signatures. So if you're trying to count and clap along in just a regular 4-4 beat, you might have a little bit of trouble staying with it. So uh, 
uh, try and see if you can hear and feel that rhythm from that iconic beat that John Bonham created with the band Led Zeppelin. So here he is, Tyler Cassianti to perform The Ocean by Led Zeppelin.
there it was and just like robert plant said it was oh so good tyler cassianti performing led zeppelin's the ocean from the album houses of the holy tyler's been taking drum lessons with us here since 2013 just a little over six years now uh, as we move into 2020 so great job by him playing that beat that switches there's some three four some seven eight all kinds of different little time signatures in that one you really got to stay active as a drummer and really focus on your counting and your rhythm to keep up with that john bonham beat our next performer getting ready to sit down at the piano going away staying away i should say from our beatles and led zeppelin theme you just saw him come across the camera. There is Cameron Coyne. Cameron has been a student here since 2012. Since he was a pretty young kid, he's uh, 14 now. We're going to be staying away from that Led Zeppelin and Beatles theme, and Cameron's going to be performing a song by Ennio Morricone called Ecstasy of Gold. Quite an incredible piano arrangement with what looks to be about I don't know, eight or nine pages there. My goodness. So I'm really, really excited to hear this, and you should be too. Here he is, Cameron Coyne, performing Ecstasy of Gold by Ennio Morricone. Thank you. 
All right. Wow, that was incredible. Cameron Coyne performing Ennio Morticone's Ecstasy of Gold. Absolutely, absolutely phenomenal. We're going to do one more piano performance here, and it's going to stay away from that Beatles and Led Zeppelin theme. We're going to do something way out of left field from Korean pop performer IU. We're going to be doing a song called Ending Scene. The performer is Isabella Jimenez. Isabella's been a student here at Van Tile Music Academy since, excuse me, since 2018. And I've been teaching her piano lessons since last year in 2019. Isabella and I have a really fun time together in our lessons because Isabella is obsessed with Korean pop, and I think it's great music. The foot piano playing on all the songs is always really interesting and cool, um, and K-pop is getting really popular here in the United States. And Isabella is 100% committed to learning these songs note for note, which is a really, really fun thing for an instructor to have a student who's just so committed to learning something that's extremely challenging, and this song is. I was unable to figure out and find out who the piano player on this track is, but his work is incredible, and Isabella has done a really great job of working hard for probably about eight months now, I believe, uh, to get this song prepared. And so she's going to perform it for you today. Here is 14-year-old Isabella Jimenez performing Ending Scene by IU. i 
there it is. Isabella Jimenez performing Ending Scene by IU. I have no idea what she's singing about, but gosh, is it beautiful to hear her sing it. And it was great to hear Isabella play that wonderful piano arrangement by the pianist whose name I was not able to find. We're going to switch on over to our vocal program now. The final section of our program is our vocalists. We have a new vocal instructor here at the school. Her name is Liz McTague. Liz started teaching with us just last month in January of 2020, and we're really excited about all the progress she's made so far with her students. All right, so our next performer here to sing for you is Kayla Huang. Kayla has been taking lessons with us for just a little over a month as well, another one of our new singing students. Kayla is going to be performing for you a song from the Beatles' Abbey Road album, released in 1969. And the song is one of my favorites from the Beatles. It's called Here Comes the Sun, featuring that iconic guitar part by George Harrison. <clears throat> so here is nine-year-old Kayla to perform the Beatles' Here Comes the Sun. she was Kayla Wong performing Here Comes the Sun by the Beatles from the 1969 album Abbey Road, my absolute favorite Beatles album. And we're ready for our next performer. This student is named Max Jagley. Max has been a student with us here at VTMA in Huntington Beach since 2017. He's 17 years old senior in high school and he's going to be performing for you a song today from the 1968 album the beatles or it's also known as the white album the iconic guitar part created by george harrison 
The song is called While My Guitar Gently Weeps. And Max is going to be performing for you his own arrangement that he came up with for solo guitar. So here he is, Max Jagley, performing While My Guitar Gently Weeps. <laughs> And there he is, Max Jagley, with his own arrangement of the iconic Beatles song, While My Guitar Gently Weeps. Great job by Max. Hey. Thank you so much for watching here from Van Tile Music Academy in Huntington Beach, California. We hope you enjoyed all of our performers today on voice, guitar, uh, drums, and piano, music from the Beatles, Led Zeppelin, and a few other artists as well. And we'll see you next time for our next concert. Thank you.